Okay guys, when you're putting together your sway bar, just note that the uh, ball ends that go into these links here, they're not plastic, they're metal. Uh, they'll be in your parts, in your uh, metal parts bag for this particular section, so just be sure that you're making, making note of that, that it, they're not plastic, they're metal. Alright guys, when you're putting in the grub screw to uh, take up some of the slack on the sway bar here, one thing that I did, because they don't want you to over tighten it, is I would tighten it all the way down till this really didn't move, not over tight, but just so that it would basically hold itself in a position, and then I would back that turn off till it would drop free. So it'd be like this, or however you have it holding, and then I'd back that screw off a little bit till it finally was free enough to move. So just a little tip. All right, guys, when you're doing the uh, battery door install, just note that the hinges here, uh, they're actually plastic, so be careful when you're putting those in. Be, you don't want them to bend too much or break on you, so just FYI. All right, guys, just one thing you want to note. Uh, once you've put the battery doors on and you've put your plastic uh, pins in, uh, each one's going to be capped with a screw. You've got a smaller screw here, I believe it's a 10 millimeter, and then an 18 millimeter one down here. Uh, so just be sure that you get them right. You don't accidentally put both of them in or flip them around because the 18 millimeter one is, is going to go and hold on the upper link mount, or the lower link mount rather, for the back. Uh, so just something else you want to be aware of. Alright guys, I want to bring one thing to your attention. When you're mounting the uh, rear link suspension, you've got four mounting points obviously, and then you've got two mounting points for the sway arm. Uh, there are six of these pins. As you can see, there, this happens to be uh, two different sizes. Um, the, the manual calls it, it says there's six and there are three by six millimeter set screw. Uh, problem is the long one is 20 millimeters, the short one is 16 millimeters. And the only thing I can figure is I've got is that there's two of the shorter ones and I believe that those are going to be the ones you use to mount the uh, sway bar into the arm back here. Uh, the longer ones are going to mount the actual uh, links to the chassis. It would make more sense that way. So uh, the manual says that they're all the same size but obviously they're not. So just be aware of that. I would save the shorter ones for the sway arm. 